Guys, Jed Walters here. Welcome to my studio here at TrueFit Golf Centre in Warrington. And today I want to talk to you a little bit about how to improve your awareness of strike on the club face and show you a little drill that you can practice uh, on the driving range. You could even practice it at home if you substitute the golf ball maybe for a water bottle cap. Um, and you can improve not just your awareness of where about you're striking on the face, but also the awareness of the circle of the golf swing and the hand path and how close to or far away it gets from you. So let's take a look. Okay, so when it comes to talking about our strike location, impact we want to try and get more consistent with is here, right in the sort of in the middle there where the, the sweet spot is. You know, obviously, I mean, I've just got a bladed iron here, so that center of gravity is not really manipulated as some would be where they're a little bit away from the face. But, the strike location and being aware of that is quite important. So we want to try and get consistent here. We need to know how to move the club to strike a little bit more here and a little bit more here. We want to try and take it in this drill to the extremes. So as you can see from the image that's just in the screen there, I've got a golf ball in between two chalk lines. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to set up as I normally would with my 7 iron here and I'm going to make from this setup position a practice swing where in a downswing I want the awareness of being able to hit the inside chalk line. So moving the centre of gravity of the club closer to the body going through into the impact and then finish. And then in the second swing I want to then be able to feel I can move it away from me so I can miss the ball on the outside and take the other chalk line. So, let's give this one a go. The lens could be in danger if we don't move it far enough that way, because then you could hit a little shank out into that way. So it's being aware of heel and toe impacts. So, setting up behind the golf ball. So the first one is going to be getting the feeling of the inside line and moving central gravity closer to me, moving the circle closer to me. And there, we've got the impact on the inside. I'll give you guys a view there. Club face, you can see chuck dust on the bottom of the face. Okay, so now, I'm gonna take the same setup. Now I wanna try and hit this line on the outside. So I'll see if I've got the awareness to move that circle further and further away as we go through. So, up to the top. So although I've gone through the right port part there, should I say, I've not quite hit that line. So I'm going to do that again because I want the club to interact with the ground in that point. Okay, so the little bit of dust came up there, a little bit of a brushing of the ground. So now what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to spray the face. So a little bit of dry shampoo on there and then when I hit the shot here we'll get an impact point then on the club face and see how close we can get to moving that centre of gravity down and through impact on the ball. So if we look there I'm going to bring this in closer to you guys there so you can see impact on the club face is right in there. So you could argue that it's a tiny little bit toe side, but it'll do for me. So if we can get the awareness of where we are, we can move the club in here, move it here. We're going to improve our ability to be able to strike the ball a little bit more there, a little bit more often. Guys, as always, thanks for watching. Uh, comment in the box below. I would love to hear your thoughts on how you have tried to improve your awareness of your strike and how much success you've had from those drills that you've tried. Um, as always, if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. If you have, thank you very much. You can follow me on social networks. The links are in the description just below the video. And I look forward to seeing you guys again next time. Thanks for watching.